Hey everyone, it's like mm, 6 a.m. on the, what are we, the 23rd today. So today is the first day of Merv. So uh, yesterday was a long drive. It took me almost uh, 12 hours to get to Goshen. And uh, when I got here, some of the other uh, makers were hanging out in the lobby. And uh, so I got to meet some of them and uh, see a few of the projects that they were putting up. And uh, there's a lot of really impressive stuff that's going to be there. So it's pretty exciting. I tried to hit the hay lot early last night, and uh, it just wasn't happening. I don't think I fell asleep until after 2 a.m., and here I am at 6 a.m., so <laughs> it's kind of got that kid on Christmas Day feeling right now. So in terms of my plans for Murph, uh, I kind of just want to take it all in. Um, I brought my uh, 3D-printed arcade cabinet, and I've got the entire thing rigged up to a battery bank. This uh, Aki one here, it's like uh, 20,000 milliamps, so... It should get between 8 and 10 hours off of this battery, so if you see me walking around with the arcade cabin and you want to give it a shot for a couple of minutes, then let me know and I'll try and find a table to set it down on and, uh, yeah, you can, you can give it a shot. Uh, otherwise, if you see me walking around, I do have a backpack that's going to have a bunch of Maker Coins in it as well as some, uh, some print and play stickers, so if you want one of those, just let me know. You're welcome to them. I did bring a couple of printers with me. I wasn't planning to set them up at the event, but we'll see how that goes as uh, as the next couple of days progress. So uh, I brought the cherry because I had a lot of people that were interested in seeing it in terms of other makers. So um, it may end up on a table, it may not. And uh, I also brought the Corality Ender 2, which uh, is one that Gearbest was actually nice enough to send me for review. And uh, so far it's been a really solid printer and I'm really happy with it and I want to see how well it traveled because uh, the thing that intrigued me about it is its, its size. It's, uh, it's pretty small, uh, but it's got a decent size build volume. It's like 6 inches by 6 inches by 8 inches, or 150 by 150 by 200. And uh, the one thing I wanted to test out before I finish my review on it is whether or not it travels well. So we'll see how long it takes to get it up and running. And uh, I figured it would help to have a printer with me in case anything breaks on the arcade cabinet or in case I need to print off some uh, extra maker coins. So yeah, it should, uh, it should be fun. So today's going to be pretty crazy. Uh, later on today, Glenn from Fun King 3D is supposed to arrive. Uh, so is Chris Riley from Chris's Basement and Colin from Colin Make Stuff. So... Uh, I know that I talked a bit about with Chris about doing a live stream while we're here, and I think that's going to happen. It'll be a probably a late night live stream either tonight or tomorrow night, but uh, it should be a lot of fun. I know that all of us uh, doing our live streams they they usually end up being a lot of fun, a lot of joking and stuff in chat. So I can just imagine how uh, how that's going to be with all of us in the same room. So yeah, let me know in the comments below if you're going to be at Merv this weekend. I'm trying to be a little bit of quiet because obviously there's a lot of people in the hotel that are still sleeping. But uh, yeah, let me know uh, down below and. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best to record some footage while I'm here. Um, that is one of my intentions, but I can see myself getting swept up a little bit in all the crazy projects and stuff. And I can definitely see me probably leaving here wanting to spend about a billion dollars on all the different stuff I'm gonna see. So I'll try and record some good footage for you guys. Uh, hopefully, I don't get like too swept up and forget to bust out my camera every once in a while. But uh, yeah, that'll be it. So keep an eye out for the live stream, and I uh, will see you guys in the next one. Alrighty, bye for now.